Hello, my beautiful people from Otoshebo Mama. Thank you for watching our YouTube channel. Please do not forget to subscribe and press the notification button. Thank you. One love. Bye bye. Sorry about that. Good evening to you all. Good evening to you all. Today we are addressing another topic, another issue that really, really caught my attention. So I still want to throw them out. We are all weather, but we are more of politics. We are all weather, but we are more of politics. Addressing the issue that is facing our people back home. You might be living a, a good life overseas, but those the people you are living in their country, they sacrifice. They made a sacrifice. That is why their country is good. And that is why we are all running here. So I believe we all can still throw our voice and make our country, our state, to be a greater one. It was good. Our state was good. When we were called empire, Great Benin Empire, we were good. If it was not beautiful, I don't think they would give us that name, Benin City, you know? A city is a place that is beautiful. A city is a place where you have all kinds of things. That is what is called beneath city. So please help me to share. I greet you all. Oh, Baba Michael, good evening. Good evening. Now, Pastor, we won't talk to today. Oh, mm -hmm. I beg if we get Pastor for yet, make on another vessel. But sometimes we still need to address some issue. When we see say things are going on in a wrong way, wrong direction. Because these days is like Christianity has become competition. Christianity has become competition. Christianity has become something that uh, you don't even want to talk about. You know, going to church these days is kind of horror film. You know, when you see the way pastors are behaving these days, when you see what they are doing these days, all in the name of money, all in the name of money, sometimes you will be scared. But that money, they are not using it to help their community. Help me to share, my people. Free, free, help me to share. I'm just sharing my own here. The money, they are not using it to help their people. They are not helping their community with it. But what they do best is for them to have private jets. Luxuries of cars. Name it all. Different kinds of car. And when you even think about it, you will find out that it's all these pastors that are even patronizing the politicians. You know? The politicians are patronizing them. Oh, Rita Bella, I greet. Good evening. Politicians are giving them money. All the that the geo, name it all. You know, they will steal from you and take it to a pastor, man of God. But when things are going wrong in the society, you will see that the men of God, they cannot talk about it. Because they too, they have also, also shared from the from the ice cake. <laughs> they too have eaten their own too. Baba I do boy, I greet. They have eaten from their own too. So they cannot talk about it. They cannot talk to the men of God, uh, past uh, politicians, when they are wrong. But what caught my attention was that uh, that the geo, that's uh, Bishop Oyedikbo, I was surprised that he sacked 40 pastors. 40. The thing surprised me of my people. Make her they go pigeon. Because now waiting they know us for. May we just they break and they go. Now waiting they know us for. So that make all of us for flow together. Make all of us for flow together. Because if I say make I go this English. I go to Russia. And people not go understand where they go. So make I just a... 
they go pigeon where they know us for. Mm -hmm. I believe our daddy Gio, our men of God too, then go do. Them too, then go see here. Mm -hmm. So my people, I come surprised, say, I see, say, for post. If they fly, they go everywhere, said, Bishop Ojedi Kbodon sack 40 pastors. It can't surprise me. Although, it's not to surprise me when I say, I say, uh, Bishop Oyedikbo, he sacked 40 pastors. Because these days, men of God, they are not after winning souls. They are just after their own pockets. They are after collecting from you, collecting from me. Just the way they themselves, some of them are even more dangerous than the politicians. Because the politicians will steal from you and me. They will take it to them and they will collect it. They will even ask the politicians to kneel down and they will bless the politicians with the name of God Almighty. Can you imagine? Somebody who is stealing from the state is bringing it to you and you will still put Bible on top of the person's head. You go say, I bless you, I pray for you. Now you go win that election. But knowing fully well that that person is not going there to do anything other than to steal. You go follow politicians share for the state money for the country money because i surprised he got one post when i still read too our daddy geo say not be uh, church money into by private jets i beg when this our daddy geo starts when this our our papa starts he not get a uh, private jet he not even start with uh, motto it not start with motto. I remember those days. They were all, uh, 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 if you check his history or how he started, he was also working on that hand, Bishop Idaosa. So for somebody to not have four private jets, the thing can't they baffle me. He can't say not be even church money. So if not be church money, where the money for they come? You know all this sowing of seed, come and sow seed. In the altar of God. Is that what God really told us to be doing as a Christian? Is that what the Bible said that you will continue every day, every Sunday, every church service? You will see the black race. May I just say, the way we, the black people, we are holding this Christianity. We are, we are following it in the wrong way. In the wrong way, religion is a big problem to the black race. Religion. It's a big problem to the black man. Religion. Don't give them things that you know when you give them. They can be easily brainwashed. That is what we black are. But the Oibo way bring and come. They know they carry and back, 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 back. The way where we black people take carry Christianity put for head. The way we black people take the make and back, 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 back. You will see some. They know they put hearing for ear. You go see some. They go say it's bad. It's not good to wear trousers. You go see some. The, the other one go talk it on. The other one go talk it on. Sometimes you now find out that most of them are not even standing in one place. Okay, look at what happened now. Prophet T.B. Joshua died. May he so rest in peace. The big, big pastors in Nigeria, you didn't see them come together to pay, uh, 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 at least with all due respect. You cannot be an enemy to a dead man. But there you see Christian. You see them. The, the, the daddy geo, the big, big pastors in Nigeria, in, in, in Africa, you will seeing them making enmity with the dead also. And tomorrow they will tell you, love your neighbor as you love yourself. How are you as a man of God when you don't even love your own fellow pastor? What are you preaching to your congregation? What are you telling your congregation to be doing? Are you, are you showing good example? You are making an enmity with a fellow pastor, but at the same time you are telling your congregation, Edgar, very. Don't condemn. Who don't condemn? You see, you are telling me don't condemn. You are one of the problem. You are one of those that are brainwashed with Christianity. How many, how many of these pastors are really, really helping the poor? It's only Pastor T.B. Joshua that I saw that is really, really doing a great things. With the poor, 
Which other ones are the ones buying private jets? The one living a, a luxurious life? But every day they tell you sow seed. Come and sow seed on the altar. Come and do this on the altar. Believe me, Christianity started from, uh, 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 from the Old Testament. But when they want to talk about tithes, they all go to uh, Old Testament. Apart from that, is every pastor in Nigeria or in Africa, are they practicing, really practicing what is in the Old Testament apart from the tithes? Pastors, they're not they practice what's in the Old Testament. Now, only tithes, all of the con they practice. Only the tithes. But that tithe, I see it as a way of brainwashing people. Because the Bible didn't say that you should be paying tithe every month. To my own knowledge, the way I've read it, it didn't say you should be paying tithe every month. Come and pay 10%. Come and pay 10%. So tell our mama, after they don't go sell pure water finish. You know this Christianity, eh? Now women, we women, now we rush our pass. Now we even make the, all these pastors come turn to second Jesus. The truth. Now we make many pastors turn to second Jesus. Because women, we always like to suspect, suspect this, suspect that, suspect this, suspect that. At the end of the day, we are running from one pastor to another, from one prophet to another, which I am not lying. Now we motivate them to now become a, 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 a semi-god on earth. Now we, now we, the human race, now we still make pastors to now feel like Sowing of seed is in the Bible. Does it mean that you have to be sowing every week? Every day? How many times some Nigerian churches are o they open every day? Today fellowship. Tomorrow this. Next tomorrow that. The other day that. Our mama, some not even they share the gay for market. But the Oibo way bring the Christianity. They know they practice her like that. Their church not just two hours. They don't close. But waiting then they raise from that church, then they go use and help people for Africa. Which African pastor you don't see say they go this village, the village they just pull uh, boil, they tie the road, they give the solar light. Let's just say they not feed, bring electricity. They bring solar light, go different different places where be say they no say people they suffer. In no day, the only person that did great is uh, uh, Prophet B. Joshua, of blessed memory. And the man was being hated by also fellow pastors. When Pastor T.B. Joshua died, it was an eye-opening that we the Christians, we preach love, but we don't love ourselves. What you say out of your mouth is not what is in your mind. You say one thing with your mouth, but your mind is telling you something else. It was an high saw for everybody to now see that, okay, now so it be, that a lot of top, top pastors, that the GOA even sacked 40 pastors now, he said they're not meet up. They're not meet up with what? With money. With money. So Christianity now is not about winning so, but it is about getting money. It shouldn't be that way. It shouldn't be that way. Christianity was for, to, uh, for us to win souls. Go ye into the world and preach the gospel. It didn't say gospel of money. It didn't say gospel of living luxury life. It didn't say gospel of having private jets. It didn't say having Omar Jeep, having Ferrari, having name it all. But today, what are we saying? It is... It, it has become competition in the Christendom. I was so ashamed seeing Nigeria pastor. They were all mute when Prophet T.B. Joshua died. Then I know that, okay, Christianity for the black man is something else. Everybody is just doing it to have a name for themselves. It is not to the glory of God, but it's just, I want to be perfect. I want to be recognized. I want to have more congregation. I want to have the largest auditorium. That is what it's all about.
It's all about luxury. It is not about winning souls. It is not about helping. If oh, you boy, we bring and come give us. They know they open their church every day. Gra, 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 gra. Sometimes two times a day. I go to Nigeria, person off his sleep. 5 a.m. you don't hear. Bro, 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 bro. 9 o'clock you don't hear. Bro, 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 bro. The thing can't be like, what did they happen? You go the year for this side, you go the year for this side. It can't be like the way where Christianity can't be. It can't be like now business. Now business. Now then you can't see some Congo they bury human being under their altar. Now then you can't see others. They 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 want to belong by force. They want to be noticed by force. The one that have five congregation is a nobody. Is a nobody. It's like Christianity now becomes Christianity now becomes something that. Uh, 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 when they are, you are practicing it, you have to belong to some certain group. You go see pastor away, be say, he really get the anointing of God naturally. He go to preach. Some of us know they like to go there. We won't like to go, you know, the black man, we always like to, not verse more than not verse so. We, the black people, we always like to near who get. I, I don't want me on my own, we don't want me on I'm your man, how what you are going here? We always like to say, I belong to the rich part. I belong to the rich society. I belong to the rich group. That is why you go see some people today, some black. Now the big, big church that they go. Now the big, big church now that they go. They know they go the one where they carry two bench put. Then under, under palm tree. Then they clap and They know they agree go that one. Because they see, say, the pastor there, they go say, now nah, dirty pastor, you know, be like I, our daddy Gio, where he get this thing. But me, why? Your daddy Gio, your children, they are brought there. But every Sunday, after service, the children go ask for money. In go send, go give them. But you, where they send the money? Your picking go come ask you say, I beg I want to buy mineral and make a sit a drink. You go say you know day. But meanwhile, three times a day, you are sowing of seed. Sowing of seed to become a millionaire. Meanwhile, you are you you go close your shop. And that one I can't they pay me pass. You go lock up your store. You they go small money where you sell for the store. You they go sow seed. How your business want to grow? And when you get there, they will tell you, so see to become a millionaire. So this to become this. So that to become that. Five years time, it can wear waje wa ubu wayeje. And at that seed, you just they so they go. You just they so the seed they go. But you see there one place. You keep on locking your store. You keep on locking your shop. And I said, Christianity is good, but we should practice it in a good way. Not be the one where person go go the sack person. You call these people to come and fellowship with you. You call them to come and win souls. It's not to come and win money. It's not to come and win money. Money, they say, is the root of all evil. What is Christianity all about today? Nobody wants to suffer. No top top pastors want to suffer. It was so shameful seeing the fact that 40 pastors, 40. Okay, the church now, who want to go there now? Okay, who go there now tomorrow now? Not confessing, bring the same amount or perform what you want them to perform. So at the end of the day, people will just want to hold on to power. They will not go and do. That is why some, they go do what they're not supposed to do. Because they just want to belong to the society. They want to belong to the group that, oh, I made it all. No matter what they use in making it. But who are the victims? It is you and I. Because we, some of us don't know where the power for they come. Some of us don't know where the power for they come. Now then you will come see woman where they husband house, mama, grandmama. Another man go come, they use and they rob her belly. They rob her. No, you, you can see all those things. Are those things not forbidden things? We should all say the truth. 
We should remember. We should say the truth. We should say the truth. Married woman, another man will not be robbing, and then tomorrow we'll be saying agua, agua, agua. Forbidding. Where is the forbidding coming from? Where is the forbidding coming from? Me, I like eh, sometimes the 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 white people who brought Christianity for us. They are pastor. The Oibo pastor, they go walk. Then they walk. Then they walk. After they close from work, if they get fellowship, then they go in the evening. Go do their fellowship. They're not just they doing like as we black just they carry them. Uh, this month, uh, fellowship crusade. The other month this. The other month that. They're not they doing like that. Because they feel say, there are people too where they bring the money, then they work too. One pastor now just come and say, now nah, he ain't get the church. He not there for abroad. All like the way we be say, he dig for we Africa. Say, pastor go say, the church now nah, he ain't get her. He not there like that with the Oibo, where he bring the church, come give us. The pastor, they go work. He they work in your money, they they feed in your family. He not sit down for house two four seven as our our African pastors they do. But now the same people where bring the Christianity, they go gather money, even the offering money. You are free. You everybody. You is 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 not compulsory, but if you have, you can give. But the one, oh, come, come and sow a seed. Sometimes I'll just go some. You'll come there, yeah. Who is going to sow seed of 1,000 naira? Baba, you want to greet. Who is going to sow seed of 1,000 naira? Come this side. Who will sow seed of 500 naira? Come this side. Who is going to sow seed of 200 naira? Come this side. Even for abroad, yeah. Uh, go to internet. They gave them. Uh, 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 I don't need to. I think you are also a pastor. That is why maybe it's painful to you that I'm talking about this issue now. Now you, they come and walk on the right. Leave Obaseki today. I not talk about Obaseki. I not talk about Obaseki today. So now pastors are they talk about? Why is it that you are so pained? Sometimes listen, so that you don't make a mistake. If you are also one of the pastor. That's why many they go kill you, man. Being they do ritual, they put under under their altar. Many people for they they come ikbere. That is why the society is so messed up today. That is why the society is so messed up. Sometimes women go 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 night vigil without husbands. No, they go night vigil. If my husband not follow me, go night vigil. I know they go. I know they go. Especially if you are married. If your husband didn't go to night vigil with you, I don't see any reason for you to go. Do I beg a pastor? The next thing, na 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 waste. Now na, na, na another man waste. Bright, weird and pay. You know, we should say the truth. A church in a or yami no bunwani. We should say the truth. Those days when we they grow up, they will say a uh, uh, married woman not they shake another man hands. Now waiting I grow up, mate. But today, what is going on? What is going on? Now then you go see, then go even carry hand across the woman shoulder and self, wrap her close to body, but in a married woman. Sometimes there is a limit to everything, and there is a discipline. That everyone has to follow. Churchy, churchy, churchy. Well, you, you can't see. They can't go the rap married woman body, rap married woman nurse, rap married woman stomach, all in the name of I want to remove something.
But the way showing the way out, what they said, is it in terms of money. Money shouldn't be a matter of anything or to sack somebody with because of money. They are not bringing forth fruit. Fourth fruit. The fourth fruit, Jesus, Jesus Christ didn't talk about money. He didn't talk about money. But why are the black always so conscious about money, 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 money? So we bring paper out, come and buy this book, come and buy this book. Those days I used to go to England. You will see, oh, come and buy Rhapsody, buy Rhapsody, buy Rhapsody. Sometimes I just feel in my mind, oh, this thing now, if you are not buying, I go be like, you will come see everybody for church. They get up, they go carry, they go carry, they go carry. One day I buy, second time I buy. Ah, the third one, I say, no, mm -mm. No, 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 no need. I better study my Bible way. Now, person where you read Bible, like you and me, now you see they write all these things. I need to study my Bible also where? I need to study my Bible. If we really want to say, we want to do what is in the Bible. Many are preaching the New Testament. What about the Old Testament? What about the Old Testament? They said there is no history, uh, no events, no history. The history in the Bible started with the Old Testament. But why are our pastors these days neglecting the Old Testament and they go to the New Testament where it will favor them, where it will favor their luxury life, where it will favor them that, okay, pastors keeping malice with a fellow pastor, keeping malice with a dead body, there was no one single that the Jew that even wrote a letter or, or for condolences, at least last lately now. And they see say uh, that the Adebo, yeah, they write a condolence. It's too late. It's, I, for me, I find it, it is too late. It's too late. It's too late. Most Christian practice malice. You as a Christian, you call yourself a man of God. And a fellow man of God, you people find him like, oh, this one not be him. This one they use another thing. But you way you know they use another thing. You couldn't show good example to who you, uh, the heart cast. Who you people castigated as the demon among you people. But the demon among you people were, was not the one helping the society, helping the needy, helping different people. But you that said you are as holy as thou, your words or your thing, your doings are not reflecting in the life of people around you. But all you want to do is to make more, make more, make more, make more, and give more. We all should be conscious. It is better sometimes we study our Bible. Start from Old Testament. Don't just go to New Testament because you want to read Bible. Start with the Old Testament. Make sure you nurture, you really, really understand what is in the Old Testament. How everything started from. Um... How everything started from, but not the one you will pick some verses, the one that will benefit you, the one that will profit you. But tomorrow, you will be telling, love your neighbor as you love yourself. A fellow pastor died, but you could not love him. A fellow pastor died. You didn't show love. You didn't show respect. You didn't even say it in your mouth. But in your congregation, you will say love your neighbor as you love yourself. Whereby you cannot even love your own fellow pastor. You cannot, you don't even want to see your fellow pastor grow above you. You don't even want to recognize your fellow pastor. If we are open our mind and our heart and our soul, we are all called by God. Depend on how you follow God. We are all called by God because we are all his children. We are all his children. You depend on how, how, how you are able to follow the words of God. Start with Old Testament. If you want to really understand the Bible, start with Old Testament. If really, really you want to practice Christianity, you want to understand the Bible, start with Old Testament. Not the one that every Sunday you see all pastors, they are going to New Testament. New Testament is just kind of a simple verse. 
A simple verse that makes life easy for everyone to follow. Nobody wants to follow the bitter road. Nobody wants to follow the uh, slippery road. But all just want to go with the, to the smooth way. No, it doesn't work that way. It doesn't work that way. How your own fellow pastor go there? No one go visit. No one even send church member go. No one even say the next thing that they sack pastors. Say the pastors not produce. He not bring enough uh, capital. Must you open hundred of churches before the whole world will know that you are serving God? That is just it. It's not compulsory that you have to have uh, 500 churches all over the world or 2,000 churches all over the world before you know that you are serving God or the whole world know that you are serving God. Because at the end of the day, even all these pastors that you sack now, maybe many didn't go to Bible school. Maybe many didn't go to Bible school. So I might just be an evangelist who we are giving another another uh, uh, suit and Bible to say, go ahead this location and be the pastor there. But those that brought the Christianity to us, they are not practicing it the way we are doing. They don't, some of them don't even have, they have one car. Many of them have one car. Those who are also living a big life, extravagant life, are also the ones in America. But the ones in Europe, na lie yo. The ones that live in Europe, na lie, they work. They work. They receive their salary every month. And they, they pay their church. They, they, if they, they pay for the rent. And whenever is, they have leftover, they take it to Africa to go and help the same Africa that we have a lot of uh, rich, uh, rich pastors. Church, they carry money from abroad. They go, they help Africa. Whereby you have all these rich pastors. Rich pastors are living in. And then a pastor will not build school. The school the pastor built. Some of the congregation cannot attend that school. They cannot pay the school fees. But every Sunday, you will go there and sow a seed. Every day, you will go there and sow a seed. You will go there and pay your free. Who is deceiving who here? Who is really deceiving who? Many of our mothers, that they lock up ch of, uh, uh, church. Some not they even cook for house. Those days... Especially for Bini. They know they even cook for house. Then they go to church, come back at 9 o'clock. Now the children will come even cook food for, for, for Papa make it eat. They know they cook. Then they go to church. Today, crusade. Tomorrow, they will bring another thing to come. Next, tomorrow, they will bring another thing to come. The other month, they will bring another thing to come. Why is Christianity like that? Why is Christianity like that? Uh, VOA, agree, sister. How are you? How can Daddy G.O. be sacking a, a fellow pastor because they, they, they didn't produce? Because they didn't produce, you just sack them. What about their family now tomorrow? That is where you've given those pastors another way to compete. Some of them will not go and do something that they, we are not supposed to do before. All in the name, they want to belong. And they want to see the daddy geo, see them that they are growing on their own. Now there are these things, they, they start where we they see, say, they'll say, oh, see this pastor, he don't go dig something under his church, oh, he don't go dig this thing before his, his altar. Because competition don't start like that. These 40 where you sack, so. The 40 goes talk and for their mind, say, they must prove this that the G.O. wrong. And they must tell and say they go belong. Now there are all these things they start. 
Christianity was to win souls, not to win money. Christianity was to bring souls to the house of God, was not to bring money into the house of God. Every day you see different, you, you see different, different topic with, uh, today is crusade. Tomorrow is anointing day. Next tomorrow is the other day. Five to seven days in a week, churches they open. Come on now. How the society want to grow? How the country want to grow? Whereby you are using seven days. Till they go church. You, you know they go work. But tomorrow, how kidnapping no go day? How stealing no go day? Whereby somebody go open church seven days in a week and now you go come attend. You, you go lock up your store. You, they go, go attend. Customers go come, then go pass, go follow another person back. But you will say your shop don't they go down. Or why you not go go down? When you not invest. God not saying uh, we must use seven days in a week to serve her. Now that one go make everybody go heaven. God didn't ask us to do that one. When I go see this uh, 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 prophet T.B. Joshua, oh. You will see this, uh, you will see uh, uh, Prophet T.B. Joshua. Now there you go really can't read all Nigerian pastors finish. Now there you see all of them finish, their character, their mindset finish. But then go stand for auditorium. They preach, waiting them believe, waiting for their own mouth to come out, come give you. Not be waiting there their heart. They will be preaching love to you, but me when they don't love their fellow pastor. Then go they preach forgiveness to you, but me when they don't have forgiveness in their heart. Forty pastors for just no reason because they don't feel bring up uh, 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 money. Must you open church across the globe? Is it compulsory that you must open church across the globe? Globe, it's not compulsory. It is not compulsory. Sow your coat according to your size. You go go just one street now. For one street for Nigeria, you will see about 10 different churches. 10. 10. As early as 5, as five o'clock. Everywhere don't cast. As early as 6 o'clock in the evening. Everywhere don't cast. But something go happen to their own fellow pastor. But you can never see them. To show concern. To even show interest. To even pay attention to it. Even member when they bring the money, they come, come they sow seed. If they, they even they seek, you will not see them helping the member. The member will even die. Many pastors now they motivate all these politicians. A lot of politicians get that the geo, then get a reverend father, then get a godfather, where they stand for them. So politician where he's supposed to tire the no green tire he carry half of the money go give it that the geo. He go pray for and I put Bible on top of his head. Yes, many of them have, they're not Greek on Europe again as they come before every week. Every week that they come Europe, can't do, can't do crusade, can't do this, can't do that. All of them, they run from COVID-19. Because now we, we, we the normal human being, now we put them for that testing. They are just normal human being like us. Now we can't hide them as God, second to God. They worship them, now we. That's why then they seek. They don't go one let people know, say, they be normal human being. Because a pastor will be say, if they give you anointing oil, may you go rob, and he go tell you, say, you are healed. 
It is your belief, it is your mindset that already heal you. But if the pastor they sick, he no go fi kon shon a koma se, in they sick. Because we don't already program them as highly to God, as holy as thou. Say, ah, how pastor go, go de take a paracetamol? How pastor go take this thing? How pastor go they do this thing? But meanwhile, pastor is just normal human being like you and me. We are all equal in the sight of God Almighty. You that is a floor member today. When that person die, it might, that person might, might just walk straight to heaven. But your daddy G.O. We go to another direction. You will be surprised. You will be surprised. Sometimes it is good for us, we read our Bible. We read our Bible to really know what the Bible says. To know what it is, it is in it. Today you go here, say, the cash pastor with another man, wife. Tomorrow you go here, pastor, do this. Next, tomorrow you go see the, the deep grave, the fine human person head. But tomorrow, now the same pastor go lay hand on your head. Now he go they touch your waist. Now he go they touch your stomach. Now he go they touch your chest. Even some pastor, he say for deliverance, he they kiss all congregation, they go. I bet my people, may we wise up. May we wise up. We black, to God who made me, we black people, we are too brainwashed. We are too brainwashed to believe the unbelievable. We are too brainwashed. Oh, you both will bring this something come give us. They know they do and the way where we they carry on. They know they carry on like that the way where we they carry on. Then they go work their eight hours, come back home like just you and me. In the evening, six o'clock, they feel come church, come do Bible study. They see go, go home. But for black people, church, now lie yo, you must bring money come. Sometimes if you carry five, 50 euro, go church, you know they come back with one euro. You know they come back with one euro. So this, so that, so this, so that, so this, so that, so that. At the end of the day, everything go empty. But on Sunday go come, you wait, they saw this, they saw that, they saw that. Now there, fear not go let you eat food. But you go see, say, pastor come out with brand new suit. McGregor. Christy Dion. The shoe, uh, me will not just talk on. But you, you they saw. For me, sometimes my sowing now is just to help the poor. That is what God really wants for us. Not to sow, 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 sow. Come be like say you they sow for pockets where you know they fool. But me, when tomorrow pastor go use and build church, the church where they build, you not go feel go put your pekin there for school there. They not go agree make your pekin enter. Now be big, big men children, they go to school. The church don't already segregate the poor and the rich also. Because if pastor they build school, now pastor supposed to build school, where it be say, everybody go fee attend. But if pastor come they build school, where it be say, now only for the rich men children. Meaning, he don't segregate the, the church. He don't divide the church. Now just message to tell you say, your hundred naira offering, no they do anything. Now the politicians where they bring out with Ghana must go. Now then they do something. For a pastor that doesn't have anything many years ago, and today he has four private jets, he is telling you he didn't make it with pastor work. It's just his own sweat. Will you go believe? Who won't believe that thing? If not just his own sweat, you not go by, me not go by. If not just in your own sweat, you take by that private jet. 
I believe me and you will for don't buy our own. If not just in your own sweat, in your own power, now you take buy that private jet. I believe people where they dig grant now with hand, then go for don't have power now. Then go for don't buy that private jet. You sack 40 pastors because of money. Money. Meaning you open the churches for them to win money, not to win souls. You open it for them to win money. You know they ever go to church, may you they benefit from them. Maybe say, ah, these things was brought out from the church free oh, this free oh, this free oh, this free oh. Especially this COVID-19. Hardly before you see pastors see go share food for their community. Hardly you not see them. Many of them not do one. Yeah, the person to blame is just you and me. It's you, you me, you, and every other normal human being. Because we are the one who put them to that level. Believe me, many of us know they call our husband, daddy, uh, sir, this. The truth. But we they always they say, daddy, daddy, man of God, daddy, daddy. But our husband, true, we have to say it. We have to say the truth here. We know the daddy our husband for house. But we always they call daddy, daddy. Now we put them. Now we, we normal, we have to blame ourselves. For a pastor that doesn't have idea of, uh, of being a, a, a landlord or a owner of a school, tomorrow is now the, uh, is now the director or is now the CEO of uh, a private school, a big one as that, even university. Who put on there? Not be you and me. Now me and you. Now me and you. Because before he started, he was just a normal human being like you and me. Tomorrow now, if he come out now, you know we black, we believe in all things. You know see what they go on so. Tomorrow now, if he just come out, carry Bible, begin the read them. I go get follow us so. Now, you know, now I talk just now. Now you and me. Now you and me put them for that post. Now we put them for the position. Now we put them say, give me only water, I will be healed. But they themselves, if then they seek the only water, they no go feed you them. Then they dodge. Now we can't make them. Can't they dodge? Because we can't make pastor be like second God. That they know they seek. They know they, it's like we can't immortalize. Eh, eh, yeah. Immortalize them like oh they're not the sicko oh, and uh, they they not they do this so oh, and uh, they not they do that so oh, because when they pray we believe that yes we are healed but if they come they sick then now go come go they hide they take treatment they will never show you show it out they will never let you know that they are sick because we don't put them for that big position where it be say everybody don't know say this is not that the go. That the G.O. is just normal human being. If he get headache tomorrow, he go take paracetamol. But many, because we don't put them, say, ah, if daddy they sick, he no go take paracetamol now. So now we can they make daddy, if he they sick, daddy go go they hide, they drink paracetamol. Because of the position, we put them. Sometimes, I believe if you read your Bible very well, you will understand and you will know how it works. Especially that tight. Because that tight on. Nobody feel just deceive me. Nobody feel deceive me about that tight on. All this every month ending. One tenth percent. In no day like that. No be so Bible tell right and say every month you must bring one tenth of your salary. Even so tell some pastor come they even they talk and say you sure say na the peanuts where you they bring come for church. Naomi I they tell they grow. You sure say na the hundred red naira where you they put for her free. Naomi I they tell they naomi the church tell they grow. No, not be your hundred naira. Not be your fifty naira the church tell they grow. 
Because they get politicians where they carry your money and my own money. Can't they give them? Can't they give them? Now me, you, and the politicians, now we put them for the high position. For a pastor to have four private jets, if they tell you, say, not be church money. For a pastor to get private schools, university, name it all, poor man, not go to school. If they tell you, say, not be church money. So where are the money for they come? Who they give and the money? Who they bring the money they come? Not be church money, but you have up to more than 1,000 churches across the globe. So if you can't be saying a church money, then you will get 5,000. No be church money, oh my people. Now, what in the talk, I quote a few days ago. Say, no be church money, you pay by private jet. So, but if not church money now, in the sack 40 pastors for church because of money. But no be church money, you pay by private jet. So, if you can't be church money, you go get maybe more than 7,000 churches. You go get more than, uh, 50,000 pastors. You go for not the same pastors. Because everybody want the money. Everybody is in need for the money. It's for the money. And some go come, they form God, they form Jesus Christ. Then go even pray for you, you will tell them, thank you, thank you, sir. Then go, they take the thank you. But instead of them, to say thank God. Then go they claim the power. No, they will not do it themselves. Because uh, uh, we black, we are brainwashed. Believe me, my dear sister. We black, we are brainwashed. The black race is brainwashed. They are, we are so easy. Easy to be manipulated. Very, very, the black man can be so, within a second, you don't manipulate him, you don't twist him, you don't change him. You don't change him. Things like this, sometimes it is good, you start letting people know that it is no, it is not bad if you not pay one Sunday offering, you not pay one Sunday tight. It is not, it, uh, God will not punish you because some people just feel, find it that, oh, if they're not pay tight this week, if they're not pay tight in next month, uh, God go punish them. Or if anything happen to them, they will say, oh, now nah, because I not pay tight too. No, it shouldn't be that way. You need to reprogram your mind. You need to reprogram your brain. God will not punish you if you not pay tight. God will not destroy your life if you not pay tight. You might be surprised you will make heaven that the geo will not make heaven. A lot of pastors will not make heaven. Because many are just for the money. They love the luxury life they are living extravagant life that they are living that sometimes when they prophesy their prophecy doesn't come true because they don't see it sometimes they might see it but because God already know that they want to take the glory and God Almighty will change it for them that's why when many prophesy it doesn't come to pass because God said no man will ever take his glory but some these days they want to take the glory of God Almighty when they talk something, the thing happen. They go say, I'll not tell you. I'll not tell you, say, go happen. Now, those things, a lot of people now, they will just see rush. Go, go, go meet the pastor. Wow. Because, hey, what the pastor talk, oh, the thing don't happen, no. Everybody now go just, they run. Ooh, they go there. But who got five congregations where be say, if they really, they follow the full step of the Bible, waiting the Bible talk and everything, some pastors they then if they want to pray for another person wife they're not the near ammo they know they go all and they touch and they touch everywhere okay like that pastor now where they kiss people they go now not be person wife in the kiss they go is that not a taboo is that not a taboo but all in the name of christianity it got one where they see those days inside church that they drink beer. <laughs> I feel fool. Every Sunday they'll just bring a ton of beer, come at war. Ah. 
Can you imagine? The whole thing is somehow, is somehow, sometimes we have to, we have to know what we are in. It is good we read our Bible. Believe me. It is good we read our Bible. You can sow all free. You can do all free. You can sow seed when you believe in it. Especially when you want something. You can pray with it and put it. Not because one pastor told you, come and sow seed. Because I don't see many. If you have 1,000 naira, come this side. If you have 20,000 naira, come this side. If you have 5,000 naira, come this side. You will come to see some, some good, even they borrow money from inside church. Some go, come go, they borrow money from inside church because they don't take money follow body. They will come see, say, ah, they are made to be said, they know, say, when they, they make shakara for, for inside church, he stand up when they say, hey, come and sell 5,000 naira. That person stand up. And then when they wear, wear everything, they not stand up for 2,000 naira. Now then they go, go, they borrow money. I beg you get money there. I don't see people borrow money inside church. Which is not supposed to be like that. It's not supposed to be like that. You know they ever see pastor give freely. Pastors, so a lot of pastors you know they give freely to the congregation. They know they even they do sarah for the congregation. Every day is so is bring all free. Every day you open church three times. Congregation come church three times. How many you show? On Sunday, some churches you know they get uh, five uh, uh, five uh, 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 distinct congregate five different congregation. Those days, a few years ago, when I go Abuja, I go visit my family. At least as early as 6 o'clock, now will be the first set. 5 o'clock, we don't come out. First set, 6 o'clock, church don't start. Service don't start. 9 o'clock, we don't reach house. Another one don't enter. That church, now the whole day, the whole day, the whole day. The whole day they open for different, different, uh, 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 uh church, uh, service. One Sunday. We don't know how much you want come out there. I want person who come to say, he don't make a, not be church money, they make a. Where are you, they make a? Go back to the way you test out, you start from, without church. Make you show us how you, they make a. Make all of us follow. Because many of us want to have that private jet too. Who no one private jet? All free time. Catholic is the best, eh? Truly, two hours they don't come out. Even Oibo Church for abroad, here. Yeah. All this Pentecostal Church, Oibo Church for abroad, here. Yeah. Two hours they don't come out. It is not compulsory. You must pay offering. You must pay tight. You must sow seed. They're not the, those ones. Not the, or you born not they even ask for seed. Or you born not they ask say consul seed. The or you born way they ask consul seed. You will not say that kid don't reach where then they. That kid don't go preach for their church. So they don't know. Now those ones who still the America. Where they say come and sow seed. Come and do this. I beg my people, make we know how we take the serve our God. May we know how we will take serve God. Not be the one where be say person will come they tell you say see 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 see. Me while waiting in the preach in on the door. Now this pastor T, uh, prophet T.B. Joshua now he leak all of them the anyash come out. All the anyash open how them be. The, now public disgrace. Now prophet T.B. Joshua give them. The demon among you people was able to help the needy, was able to do it. He was not living a, 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 a extravagant life. But in a way, be holy, the holy are No message of condolence. You couldn't pay visit to the wife. They didn't do this. But tomorrow they will be the one to tell you, don't keep malice. Don't do this. Love your neighbor. 
uh, forgive and be forgiven, do this and be that. But meanwhile, they are not practicing what they preach. They don't practice what they preach. But they will tell you to be practicing it. But they are not practicing it. Because if then they practice her, you know, go for the show, say, Pastor, they sleep with another married woman for his house. But now the same pastor go tell you, say, Thou shall not sleep with another man's wife. But in the door behind closed door. So, my people, we all have to be wise. We don't need to be brainwashed. God not say we, uh, if we not go to church seven times in a week, we not go make heaven. Not be so Bible talker. Not be so God Almighty talker. And even the abroad where we are, they run, they come. Not be five times, seven times a week. Now either they make and way be say their country better like this. Way be say all of us, they run, they come. Even then, the daddy the geos and all, all of them, they come here, come take treatment. Then they come here, come rest. If all Igbo people do it like that, I'm not sure say all of us go fit come here, come they stay. They don't use all their day, two, four, seven. They go church. They go here. They go there. They go there. No, they don't do it like that. There is a time for everything. There is a time for everything. Not be two, four, seven. Two, four, seven. Open church. Open church. Open church. And crime still there the place. Pastor go, they preach to you. He go get bodyguard. Pastor go, they preach. He go get bodyguard. Yes, so many of them. Have you not seen pastor that is having a bodyguard? What is what you don't know, don't say it. These are the people that are being brainwashed because I know a lot will come today with their comments, but I don't want to be brainwashed. I don't want to be brainwashed. Okay? I don't want to be brainwashed. A man of God cannot build church, a church whereby the poor cannot go. A man of God cannot build church, and that church, uh, that, that uh, school, uh, the poor children cannot go to that school. Is that what the Bible says? Is that what the body of Christ says? That a pastor will not build church and the poor uh, masses cannot go to that school. The black people, the black race, they are easily brainwashed and very difficult to change their orientation. Very, very difficult. Very difficult. Now small Ibo just can't do. Small. Now when they see what you know Ibo not get for have for, for, for what you know Ibo bring come, they not get her. Many of them begin to submit. That is what we are. They that brought the Christianity to us, they are not doing it the way we are doing it. They are not making holy adal the way we are doing it. But they just tell you, even if you call them daddy, they will tell you no. Call me by my name. Call me by my name, or you call me pastor this with my name but we black people no we love to all oh, daddy papa many are not many are not real christian in the sense that some i said it before at the beginning i said some pastor now we get five congregation with two bench they sit down on that bamboo tree. No, no roof, no zinc, nothing. Rain go, they beat them there. Nobody won't go that church. Especially when you don't wear nice clothes, nice shoes. You know what go sit down inside dust. Now we are AC and air condition there. Now then you go go sit down. I've been a lie. I'm not lying. So everybody is a, we live in a society or we live in a world where everyone wants to be associated with the rich with the rich rich richness is money everybody want to be friend of a rich man everybody want to be a brother a sister to a rich man nobody want to be a friend of a madman 
He get one video where he circulate one time where the pastor himself turned himself to a madman or a beggar sit down for near a church. Disgust himself. All the church members begin to pass out. But when the pastor comes inside church, all of them open mouth begin to shout, whoa. The pastor just showed an example of what Christ really wanted from us. That we should help the poor and the needy. It's not bringing your 5,000 naira or 20,000 naira into the, into the auditorium. That will make you to make heaven. No. You, they come to church. Your brother, they hungry for road. They beg you for money. You not agree give up. You go say, ah, this one a ritual. If you go use my money, do something. But you don't know whether that person is really in need of that money. Then you'll say you, they bring her and they come to uh, church. You don't even know if that person sitting along the road begging you for money is Jesus Christ himself. You don't even know if that person just want to test you, that Jesus Christ himself want to test you, if really you are really following the doctrine of God Almighty. You don't even know. So it is good sometimes we have sober, uh, sober reflection of whatever we are doing in this life. Your neighbor not fit come beg you for, uh, for, for Gary or for Oye. You, you get, but you say you don't get. You go lock your door, you they go church. You won't go sing, oh see, go see, go praise the Lord. But meanwhile, you forget that your neighbor will ask you for salt, for oil, for Maggie, before you come church. Is that what Christianity is about? When you preach love, love, loving somebody means, it's not, oh, I love my sister. No. Loving somebody means open your door for that person. Give whenever you have. Give to that person. Not the one you come church and you come and do notice me. Oh, now me they pay tight pass. Now my tight big pass. Now my offering big pass. Now me do this pass. You will come and shake the beast in the church. But you just left a beast at home. You left a beast at home. If somebody come to ask you for salt and water you didn't give, is that not a beast? But meanwhile, you have it. But you just don't want to give. So what are you leaving behind? What signal are you sending? But you will be the happiest one in church. You will be the best dancer in church that very day. Is that the body of Christ? Is that the preaching of Christ? Anyway, for me, I, that is just what I have to say about this 40, 40 pastor, 40, 40. It's too much. It's too much. You sack 40 pastor. Tomorrow now, those pastor, it is what they know now. It is pastoral job they know, no other job now. The only thing for them now is to go and open their church also tomorrow. I be not be so. Now for them to go open their own church tomorrow. So 40 new churches is also coming. You have a society where the churches are more, more than company. How will the nation grow? How will the nation grow? One street go get 20 churches, but no one factory there. No one factory there. How will the churches grow? How will the state grow? How will the country grow? How will the youth move forward? For me, it doesn't mean if you have uh, 50 churches, the people there might not even make heaven. But you helping humanity, you will make heaven. The money when you want to go open 50 church, don't use and build factory. Use an open company where people go employ, even if you know why employ us that employ the church people, make that they go work there. They produce something. They produce something from that company. Employ people, that is humanity. Not be to go open church, 5,000 churches all over the world. We need to start, I beg my people, I don't feel because I don't see a lot here. I don't see a lot. Oh, he brought away be pastor, but he gets in your company where he employ people. 
After he closed from his own work, he go go church, go do his pastor work. On Sunday, they come, come preach. But our African pastors, they know they work. Now, 247 opening of church. But when they now have the money, but they will not open company. They will not open factory across the globe. They will not do all those things, but rather is to open more church, more church, more church, more church. How will a nation survive? Where there is little company and many church, will that nation survive? You can open your company and give the church name to the company. It's no problem so long you employ people and be paying them salary. Produce something for the country. If not company, then they open across the globe so. As the way where they tell they open churches. Believe me, uh, uh, Nigeria would have been the, uh, uh, the most blessed nation on earth. On earth. I think number one uh, 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 richest uh, black uh, pastor now Nigeria, now Nigeria pastor. So we will come say we not get company. I beg my people, I don't want to talk and reach. Now good night. Yes, everybody want to be seen among the rich, my dear sister. It is true. Everybody want to be noticed with somebody that have the bigger platform. Everybody want to be to be friend to those that have the bigger. Everybody now is it, that is 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 it is what we black we are. Believe me. That is why oh you both manipulators, because they no say we like material things. They know say we like material things. We like to associate. Now then you go see some people, their mama go poor, their papa go poor. Then go even deny their mama, their papa for their friends. Say no. Now that their uncle, even their neighbor, where he get uh, 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 upstairs those days. Now that one go be their house. Now then go be their papa, their mama. Or oh, should not be their papa. Then just rent one, two room there. Me don't see person where he deny papa and his mama. Because say they don't get. But if you see him with some things, if they go borrow for the neighbor children, neighbor rich man picking children where they, they play together. If they go borrow those ones where. But if she can they claim say she belongs to that family. That is the society we are. Everybody want to be as to, to associate themselves with the rich people. Nobody, people, they deny their parents anyhow. Say, cause say money no day. Nobody want to be noticed with a poor father or a poor mother. I saw many, even people where their papa their village those days. Then go say no. Their pap dad, their papa, and their uncle. Especially when some papa go come come school those days. <laughs> Me and I laugh. When some papa go come school those days, you know now papa will come from village. Some go even carry Gary come, come school, say may they give them if they, they go us. May they carry and go us. Because in just they come from village. When you go the third and say your papa they come, he go say not be papa. Na i papa senior brother. Me wa na i papa. Na i papa. He denied the... <laughs> now we women do a pass. Oh. <laughs> now guests do those things pass. <laughs> I bet my people make a live now. Everybody want to associate with the rich. You will see young pastor. They manage, they grow. They're not they go. Now the one way get name, way get big, big name. Where if you come out for street, everybody they run follow. Now people want associate with. So that is what is in we human, we human being. Especially the black, the black now they talk. We black. Very easy to manipulate. Very, very easy. 
my goodness my people god bless you all thank you for watching thank you all tomorrow i might come out with another topic but if you are a christian read your bible very well read your bible very very well make sure you understand it especially the uh, the genesis uh, the uh, 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 yeah the whole testament read it and understand it read it to your own understanding and see how the bible talk about tight is not a a a monthly thing that every month you must produce your tight the bible didn't talk about it that way but it's just we human beings that change it that every month you must give one tenth every month you must give one tenth those days may i not talk good past there so i will have your turn may i leave you now now good night <laughs> Go and read your Bible. Read your Bible very well. Don't allow people to brainwash you. Read your Bible. It's good to have a pastor. It's good to have a, a, a reverend father. It's good to be closer to man of God. The man of God that will really teach you that is money is not everything in Christianity. Money is not everything. I've seen a pastor that has been a pastor for the past 20 years. Now one car he gets. One. Just one one but people like that nobody want to associate with people like that everybody want to associate like that 20 years and i go for don't get many brunches different different cars and all and all and all all men of god are not the same they are not like that all are not the same so thank you all so much good night